Excuse me. Today was kind of rough at work, so I don't know if I have the energy to, like, do a let's play, or at least the concentration. Um, but I do owe you guys a video, and I want to stop leaving days blank that should have a video available for you guys. Does that make sense? I'm not sure. It does in my head, but then again, my head is weird. But like I was saying, today was kind of, um, well, how do I put this? You know, I'll just come out and tell you. So, there I was at work, doing work stuff, and I squatted down to pick up a, a heavy piece of material, and I heard a rip. In my pants. My initial thought was, oh no, not more of this. Because I'd already patched up my pants before, it's nothing new. Pants in particular seem to get really torn up at my place of work. Now, initially I just ignored it and left it be for a little while because what are you gonna do in the middle of work? Just a bit of a rip, no big deal. But then I realized I was feeling a breeze in a very peculiar spot. Yeah, the rip was a lot worse than I thought it was and it was straight down the middle of my booty crack. Um, my butt would have been exposed had I not worn undies today. Fortunately, I wear them every day at work because no. Now, being at work, there weren't too many options I could do to patch that up or cover it. I couldn't just leave and get new pants. Maybe I could have, but I'd probably get in trouble for it. But at the time, I figured I'm stuck here. There's not much I can do. The only two options I could think of were tape or like drape a rag over my butt and like have kind of a security flap. I was about to do that, then I realized all of our rags are white. It would kind of look like a white flag. And uh, you know what white flags signify. For all I know, that's a signal in certain communities that you're ready to give up the booty. I normally don't think about that kind of thing until this particular situation arises. And I wasn't particularly fond of the idea of giving my co-workers more ammunition to razz me. So, tape it was. But this was a big rip, and I wanted to make sure that it wasn't gonna rip again. So I grabbed a roll of duct tape, went to the honey bucket, because that was the closest place where I could find any privacy whatsoever, and dropped trowel <laughs> to slap strips of duct tape in my pants. Both sides. And also hoping that none of my co-workers approached to hear the distinctive sound of duct tape being pulled. Be honest, me explaining it to you made you hear the sound in your head, right? And so with that all done, I was all patched up for the next five hours before I could hightail it out of there and get a new pair of pants for the rest of the week. Felt a little weird on my butt, but let's be honest, that's not the weirdest sensation I've ever felt on my body. And no, I will not get into that. I swear, the last couple of weeks I've had nothing but bad luck regarding pants. Uh, this might be a bad omen. Well. That's my story. In all honesty, I thought it was pretty amusing in the moment as well as thinking back on it. Also, what about you guys? Do any of you have any amusing stories of being caught with your pants down? Figuratively speaking, or literally. Either way, I'd like to hear from you. Leave a comment down below. If you liked this video, give that like button a bop, and I'll see you in the next video. Hopefully, it'll amaze.